Finally, in years to come, we'll probably still be asking each other what we got up to during lockdown. Aside from the baking and the box sets, there's been an army of knitters taking part in what's affectionately known as yarn bombing. They've been creating decorative cosies for post boxes and poles, covering hundreds right across the country. And for them, it's been a key part of coping with lockdown. Sangeeta Lal reports. They've popped up on post boxes all over the country homemade handiwork that brightened those long days of lockdown. An unusual hobby Jane says she never knew she needed. It's really bizarre. Um, I, I've not done many more bizarre things than this, frankly. Okay, this one is to go outside a children's charity. So I wanted something that children could relate to. It's just a nice thing to have um, memories of the beach, even if you're not going there. And even on a day like today, how much have you seen it help people? And I've really loved, you know, the community spirit that we've had locally, just making all of these, these just really quite incredible things. There's such creativity out there. And the so-called yarn bombing is catching on, from Lancashire to London. Somerset to Sussex, these carefully crafted post box toppers just can't be ignored. It's really fun and it makes me really happy. What about it makes you so happy? Um, all the animals are smiling and it brings joy. A joy that will now never be forgotten. After noticing them on a run one morning, this author decided to write a book capturing the lockdown letterboxes. We uncovered mystery, intrigue and crime. Some post box toppers were nicked and found in another area. There's anonymous knitters who didn't want people who know who they are and do it under the cover of darkness. So much drama in these yarn bombs. It's amazing. There's scandals, there's drama, there's intrigue. It's a world of its own. And one Belinda now wants to share with this new knitting community that pulled together through a pandemic. Sangeeta Lal, ITV News. I think I want to join in.